How, am I saying your name wrong? It's pronounced Pisia. Pisia, Pisia, okay. So we got 250 gold for a curse, max HP, or random rare card. Now, random rare, we can get the curse and a lot of gold and maybe do something at the shop. Now, the paths are interesting because we have one, two, three, four rest, no elites at all, and just we, maybe we get rid of the curse, go for a shop, use our gold. Over here, we got one, two, three, four elites and four rests. And it's crazy. I feel like there's two extremes. We go for three rests, maybe one elite, or just four rests, one shop, no elites, or four elites, four rests. It's crazy. You suck at this game? I kind of do too, man. I kind of do too. There are days where I'm uh, all, all over the place. How you doing, man? How long does it take you to beat this stuff? Well, I have a lot of hours, man. But uh, I also have card game experience. So if you like card games and strategy, hey, it's very for everybody. Essentially, if you've seen on... Uh, Want to go YOLO? I, I think... I mean, random raiders are pretty good because these are good raiders, right? So let's just go for the good raiders. Uh, I would have liked the gold. I'm being not, if I'm honest, I'll, I like the gold. It's okay. Let's go this way. You love card games with strategy? Then you should... You, you'll pick it up, then. You'll pick it up. As long as you have an analytical mind, you're analyzing your mistakes and stuff. You'll pick it up. Too defensive? I mean, that's a good, that's a good problem to... Uh, to address. Yeah, so then maybe you're going too defensive. And you gotta make sure you, so front loaded damage. Oh, why do I always click that? I hate them. Front loaded damage is important. So there are times where you're gonna need front loaded damage to deal with people who scale quickly. Or, you know, just to eliminate threats to make your life easier. Sometimes people try to defend a threat that would be much easier to deal with if you just had the damage earlier to just kill it. You know what I mean? That, and that's something so like things like for instance, the defects has Sunder. I don't know if you've played the defects, but have you considered Sunder as a card you like? It's a pretty good card. Oh, he's a Hearthstone caster. Oh, so then he then he knows. Sunder is 32 damage and 3 mana. But if it kills an enemy... Oh! I didn't actually want that. But if you kill an enemy, you uh you get energy back. What the hell's going on? What is going on? Oh my god. You know what? I'll just I'll embrace it. This is a doom run. This is doomed. So, you know, as, as a tip to you guys, you know, you guys are in that event. So if you see a curse, click a card you know for sure there's not. Like, so let's say you already clicked a card, you know what it is. If you see a curse, click that same card you just saw. So that doesn't happen to you. But we're gonna get Duvudal, right? It's gonna come together, right? Duvudal's gonna happen. Trust me, this is all for a reason. It's all gonna come together. Don't you worry. Cool headed. Damn, that's a lot of curses. Wow. Defrag hyperbeam? What a what a wow, okay. This is something. What's up, Shrain? How you doing? Three curses, we're on floor six. Could be worse, right? Oh! My god, what is this? What is this? This is crazy. You know what's funny though? I'm pretty sure that event is coded. That event is coded that if you have more than one curse, I believe it's more likely to pop up. In fact, I think it only pops up if you have more than one curse. So yes, it's lucky, but at the same time, I think it's it's higher probability. Oh, <laughs> uh, the one thing I don't like though is, I mean, we have Hyper Beam, right? Well, I think Hologram Hyper Beam. Is a play that we could do? Who's the boss? A slime boss? So slime boss is like hyper beam is good for a slime boss, but at the same time you also kind of want the focus with defrag. I think loop is just a leap is just a really solid defense to have. Although I think hologram could be some kind of sexy with this as, as well. Since we have defrag, we can do hologram zap and get more lightning. So I think I'm gonna do hologram here. 
Amplified Defrag is something I could consider. We can spend gold to remove. Now, here's the thing about this this dilemma right here, because I have 308 gold, and there's a shop coming up. I would hate to spend my gold, and then I can't buy something potentially really good. And I think Clockwork Souvenir is something that's really good. In fact, it's actually kind of a hard choice between... Oh, you gotta go. It's a care beta chest. Like, Gremlin Horn is really good as well, but I think Clockwork Souvenir with, like... First of all, it will counteract the Hyper Beam, and it also is really good with Bias Cognition. I think we'll just take it. Although, Gremlin Horn is really good as well. Yeah, it's great for negative focus on Hyper Beam. It's also, you know, Bias Cognition. We can, we can remove a card or we can buy something else. Um, If we remove a card, we're basically going to have a deck that's just like... Some defense, some focus, right? Like Zap to play Lightning and then the Hyper Beam. Whereas if we buy Streamline, we have a little bit more front loader damage. I kind of like the Streamline. A little bit more kick in our deck. Because right now our offense is really limited. No, Clockwork's great. Clockwork's 100% great. Um, sometimes it's awkward to proc, but other times... Well, actually, I mean, you always have it. You gotta be careful. Because you can't, like, control when it happens. But it works with potions as well, so we can look for potions. Does the event... No, the event does not get rid of Necronomicers. That's never... That can never get removed. I think I like Streamline more than removing here. Especially against the Hyper... Uh, against the Slime boss. Hmm. But this is also like a common card I can always find, whereas I think removing is the hardest to take. Harder to get, right? Like, there's a chance that I can find Streamline pretty easily. Let's, let's go ahead and remove and take the opportunity to remove. It's about opportunity cost, right? I'm, I'm an upgrade hologram. Because right now, I think one of the things to get offense is going to be Zap, Hologram, Zap. Well, and since we also have focus, you know... Cool headed. Hologram cool headed is not bad either. Omomori can prevent it, yep. So Omomori can, can prevent the uh, Necronomicus from getting into your deck. But once it's in your deck, you cannot remove it. Boom. So Stereopod is also a good way to use Clockwork Souvenir. We got Streamline, anyways. You see what I said? This is what I was talking about. Common. I was gonna buy it, you know what? I removed it instead. And look what we got, a streamline. Now I'm gonna upgrade to Hyper Beam because in this fight, that kind of front loaded damage is insane. Now part of me wants to uh, use this area pot just because he's about to do a negative effect. So I'd rather, you know what, take advantage of my artifact before he takes it away. And I'm gonna go straight for the face. Now machine learning is not bad because he does do a deck debuff and there's also a lot of slime. But this is also 33 damage I can do right now. Uh, this is a problem though. Like this is really good damage, but at the same time it's Well if we do hologram, if we get a hologram we... well, so what is he gonna be at? That's 78 damage if I get a hologram. Oh f I didn't do the math. That is the worst split I've ever done. That's a really bad split. It's only getting worse. I'm making it worse and worse. I'm gonna have to use focus pot. I have negative four. Why did I use focus pot? I'm I'm tired, guys. All right. Hyper beam is gonna happen again. It's okay. We're gonna get it again. Okay, okay, okay. This is fine. Everything's fine. Just relax. Everything's fine here. How much damage is that? Thirty. No problem. No problem. No problem. Okay, so I fucked that up extremely bad. I ideally want to get him right above split and then do Hyper Beam again to split him for a really good... But it's okay, though. The so Bicep Ignition with Clockwork is really damn good. Echo Form is really damn good. Electrodynamics is really damn good. But we kind of have Hyper Beam for the AoE, which Electro is doing. Echo Form is obviously really good, but I think because we have the Clockwork, it's biased, no contest. Now, at this point... You no longer smith, you can get fewer card selection. I really like smithing. 
I really like smithing. I'm gonna take Busted Crown. Mm, but I also need better cards. Like I need Glacier and stuff. Hmm. Apart at this point, because I have bias with Clockwork and Defrag, I can kind of just get rid of Hyper Beam altogether down the line. I like the Smith, but there's ways around it, right? We talked about how there is, you know, Mind Bloom, Apotheosis. We can get upgraded cards. We can get Toxic Egg or any egg at all. Whereas this. I uh, will take the fusion. Going against the hyper beam, man. Bronze automaton. Okay. I could probably do an elite. I, I think most of the elites get wrecked by my deck right now. It's just about whether or not the elites are worth it. Yeah, I might go for this elite right here. Why Cognition? Well, because I think Cognition is so good for like a turn like this. But, but it could have been uh, a misplay. I'm not... I'm not doubting that possibility. I can go for the... Nah, it doesn't even work. I'm doing good, Jimbody. How you doing, man? So this does, what, 18 damage? Wait. Hologram is not good here, unfortunately. Alright, well, good thing we can only rest, right? Auto shield? I dig it. Auto shield upgraded, too. Anything that's upgraded has more value, and that's a pretty good block as it is. So I'm actually going to let, you know, the artifact take, take control here, of course. Not bad. I think the fight's going to last short enough that I can just do biased. Now it's between getting some frost. I think so. I was going to get frost or do streamline. Nah. We'll be fine here. So, what after Hyper Beam is done, this is going to be, what? Like, 4 damage? 3 or 4 damage? 6 damage in total? Plus 25. Well, isn't this just lethal? What am I saying? <laughs> so, that's really nice. Ooh, White Noise. So another hologram is not bad because we can do this hyper beam combo more often, which is pretty damn good, especially for elite fights. But a white noise is really damn good too. Let's see hologram again. Capacitor Sunder. Claw Stack. I suppose we can move another strike. Uh, so I can prevent his thing now. I'll, I'll take the focus here. Yeah, I'm tired. I'm tired today. I'm tired today. It's all good, though. We're still, we're still trucking along. Spirebot broken? Yeah, I think Spirebot is broken. I have, to, I, have to, I have to mention to the guy. I think Spirebot is broken. I'll just do this anyways. We have enough focus that it's okay. Do you think she could stand to be scaled with floor? There's no reason to buy it later than halfway through Act 1. Streamline plus double energy barrage. 
Streamline plus. I mean, that's a nice way to keep getting offense that... I don't know. I don't know if I want Streamline plus. I already have one in my deck. It's a, it's a big hit. Like, don't get me wrong. It's a probably big hit. And once you play it once, it's a, like for... If you just play Streamline once, it's immediately just a great card. 15 or what? 20 for one? I know. Clockwork and Vice Cognition. Take it. We'll, we'll mess around for a little bit. All right, do not mess me over this time. I like skim. I like zap. I might take another. Oh, buffer. I like. I'll take the buffer. Hey, what's up, Loth Arena? Oh, I haven't seen you in a while, Grace. How's work? I remember, I remember it is you, Grace. I remember. Oh, we're gonna get the negative effects. I think they gonna take the artifacts. Feels bad, man. It feels bad, man. Do we do bias anyways? I think we'd get another frost. Actually, this is pretty cool. I like this. Chilling and watching your stream. Good to hear it, man. There's no reason for me to do Hyper Beam here. Oh, if we had Hyper Beam. No, we didn't have 5 energy, right? No, we're fine. I, mean, I can still do it. I'd rather do this. Fortnite went well, man. It was, it was fun. We had some good games. Um, I don't think you missed too much, though. How was how it going into the town go? What'd you get? It's Fortress. It's weird, but it works. Uh, I think Hyper Beam is just weird in general, so it, it throws people off. Because Hyper Beam kind of just... So my deck is pretty... Like... Right now it has like defense, some focus, and some front loaded with streamline. But the hyper beam is what throws it off. But if you take out the hyper beam, it's fine. I think loop is fine as well. We're getting pretty lucky with upgraded cards. Dexterity pot. I might take the dexterity pot for the, the bronze guy. I think I might take it for the, the bronze animatum. Or you know what we're gonna do? Not play hyper beam. We're just gonna scale up with focus. We're not gonna scale up, but we're gonna have enough focus. Maybe we're fine. He actually might be a, a hard fight for us, guys. Because we can either block a lot with Focus and Frost and, like, try to survive and just do damage, I guess, with, like, Streamlines and stuff. Or we play Hyper Beam and then we're going to have trouble blocking. So that's why I think Dexterity Pump might be the play, but... At the same time... There's another shop coming up, so I can probably buy something else. Or I can use the potions I have on the Elite right here. I think I'm going to go for Elite, see what happens. I'm going to skip here. I miss you on YouTube. I know we're gonna. I'm gonna get back on YouTube. I'm sorry about that. So Dreamcatcher with fusion's not bad. Another defrag, all for one. Chill, streamline, consume, aggregate, rip and tear, hologram, sunder. I think we're gonna go ahead and do another defrag. So yeah, now the the hyper beam is pretty awkward. Cold time for more frost. Biased first turn, not bad. I think this guy... This is awkward. Damn, he's doing a lot of damage straight up, up right off the top. It's like... It usually takes a second, but he's just going for it. I don't know, he seems to be pretty strong all of a sudden. He, like, he just ramped up immediately. I don't know about you guys, but that's like the first time he's ramped up like that for me. It's kind of nutty. 
can do streamline for the front loaded or I can go for cold snap. I mean, we're gonna have to rest anyways. I think we gotta go for damage, guys. Although cold snap is not bad either. So, guys, we were in the middle of a crazy intense run. Talk about... Talk about an intense, intense cliffhanger, right? We had just beat the Ironclad. One HP. So, Trico, we were here in the normal time. We were streaming. We we're, we we're killing it. The power went out. And since the power went out, we just we just got the... We just got the power back. I ha Actually, if you guys noticed, the background's a little bit different. I had it. I'm changing the background up, so the couch is missing for right now. Oof, I'm sweating. It's hot. Because the power was off, the AC was off. Anyways, we're back. We were, guys, we were in the middle of a book of stabbing fight. It was getting intense. It was getting intense. Now, I, feel, I don't know if you guys remember this deck or not, but we have Clockwork uh, Artifact Souvenir, rather, and we have the Bias Cognition. My, my, my lord. Now, we're thinking to ourselves, oh. It's not, I, I meant to do Fear Pot, mm. One sec. I think last time I did Streamline there. No, I think I did the, the Frost. Twenty-two damage versus block block. Loop. So he's doing forty-two. I have twenty-four. I think I was blocking more last time. He's just scaling up like crazy right now. Oh, because of loop, auto shoot doesn't work. Is there a way to block with Avenue's fire pot? Let me see. He's doing 56. I have 27. He's doing 56, am I right? And I have 27 right now? With 9, time, nine times 3 is 27. So we're fine. Ay, ay, ay. Okay, we just came back into that massive cliffhanger. We got Beam Cell, all for one, consume now. I think Beam Cell might be the play, guys, because I was thinking, how am I going to kill the Bronze Automaton? And I think, okay, Beam Cell, if I get him vulnerable, but here's the thing. We have Vulnerable Pot, and also, the Beam Cell is going to be not upgraded, but I don't have a way to get rid of his artifacts without with nothing else, so I think we should do Beam Cell for that sake. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. What's up, Robin? How you doing, man? Uh, not much, man. I just got back here. We're gonna do... So, the one thing I do want is more Frost, which is great. And the fact that it's upgraded is even better. We're just continuing this run, man. We kind of cut short by a power outage, and here we are. I'm not looking forward to this one, either. Oof. Uh, the power's good now. Power's good now. Should we do this? I feel like, honestly, it's gonna bite me in the ass to get rid of my focus, I feel like. I feel like it's gonna bite me in the ass to get rid of my focus. I think it's the heads up play. I don't wanna take any damage because I, I need to be healthy for the next fight. Because I need to be as healthy as possible against this guy. Power outage. Yeah, no, it was something wrong. Like, my, my, my power company decided, like... I don't know what they were... The building got fucked up. It was crazy. It was hot as hell. Hyperbeam? I think, yeah, we can afford a hyperbeam here. Oh, 
Hologram again. I'm gonna skip. Alright, we're gonna rest again, boys. Uh, I'm gonna skip. Alright, so... I, I'm gonna hold off on Hyper Beam here. We got Bias Cognition right away with the artifacts. We got this, and... Alright, let's go. Tell me about it, Trico. We gotta get our Frost Orbs out ASAP. We had such a good stream going too, guys. We were getting, getting we got a, lot, a lot of peeps coming in. We had a really good stream going, man. It's getting hot and heavy, man. It's all good though. But this is gonna be a better stream. This is the night stream. Where my night boys out? Woo woo! Woo woo! Jeremy, what are you doing? You're, you're making us cringe. Can we go back to the morning where you weren't cringing us? No, man. Listen, it's the night, Jeremy. This is cringe, Jeremy. Uh, six to focus turn one. I know. Bum, bum, bum. Yo, buddy. That's a lot of frost. That's a lot of frost, big boy. Let me show you something real quick. I call this the... What? I don't know what I'm going on about. It's hot, man. Get rid of the artifacts. We gotta do it. Let's put some, let's put some lightning on that. You can't buy anything because the shot power's out. You have my buffer. Yo, I didn't even realize you were deboing my buffer. Now that I don't appreciate. So here we're gonna get beam cell. We can't get beam cell, never mind. I'm gonna do shim just to make it cheaper. Cause that's gonna be my damage, guys. Once we get the artifact off, we're gonna be doing pot, fear pot with like um We're doing fear pot with like streamlines and stuff like that. Maybe hyper beam to finish it off at the end. There's the beam cell. Now we're going to do Fear Pot. Well, before we do Fear Pot, let's stay alive. Uh, I'll do Fear Pot next turn. I should probably get the Lightning there, actually. Do Fear Pot now. Hologram, or just I, I, get more Frost? Let me see. I, I'll do Hologram here. Okay, we also have Hyper Beam. Remember, we have Hyper Beam Hologram plays, but that's 70 damage to the face. And we have Buffer. Ooh, since we have Buffer, how do we feel about doing Hyper Beam and then Buffer? Are we willing to get rid of our stuff so far? I don't think so. I think we have enough Frost that we don't have to, like, commit like that. That's 18, right? So that brings me up to 72, so we can block and have the Buffer still. And now we can probably go ahead and... Do a little bit of hyper beam. Yes, sir. Whoo! We are killing it, guys. If you guys saw the beginning, I don't know if you guys remember the beginning of this. Guys, the beginning of this run. Let me just put this in perspective. I had four curses in my deck on floor six. So Treko wasn't here. So I know we have hyper beam, which is weird and counteracts each other, but then we also have, you know, the artifacts, which sometimes can beat for the hyper beam. But here's the thing, Hyper Beam, since I have like Defrag and Bias Cognition, I could just play Hyper Beam as like a finisher or as like really good damage up front with like Hologram, do it twice. Anyways, we had four curses, Act 4, 6, and if you guys are thinking the deck looks kind of weird, if you guys can go back in the VOD and check it out. Let's go do uh, Seek here. We got more, no, we got Calling Bell, Running Dome, or Inserter. Now, Inserter is kind of nuts because... We have the focus to pay the bills, so all we need now is the orb slots, and this gives us the orb slots. And then we have the focus to pay the bills, I would say. So let's go ahead and do it. The air's on, right? Damn, it's hot. Trail, uh, Dono and Deca. So we got Dono and Deca for sure. So you can maybe the Waken one or the Time Meter. I, I prefer the Time Meter, but I think we are in a good position to kill both. Um, let's go for the shop and see what we got here. Now here's the thing, though. Oh, check this out. Okay, never mind. Yeah, I don't have a way to upgrade cards, so... my blue event would be nice, but... We've been kind of lucky and fortunate... To find... So here's the thing. Hyper Beam could be played like this because of the artifacts. I've been fortunate to find upgraded cards from Dreamcatcher and stuff. We got lethal here. 
Yes, sir. Go for the ice compile. I like compile for the card draw. A little bit. Is it going to be making the deck a little bit too inconsistent? We already have machine learning, so we don't need compile, right? I feel like it's making the deck inconsistent. The weaken? Nah, we're going to skip, skip. I don't like this turn. It's a pretty bad turn, boys. It's actually going to be a rough fight because this guy is going to be doing the dazed. I should have just done strike there. Hmm. We're going to have to do Hyper Beam here if we can get it. I have to do Hyper Beam just to stay alive. Like, Bias Cognition is obviously really good. So if I do Bias Cognition, I can get a shit ton of Frost. Maybe that's better. So I get a shit ton of Frost and I do Cold Snap, Cold Snap. Do I take damage? I feel like I do because the guy's doing 30, 30, right? So with Bias, I'll have... 1, 2, 3, 3 Frost with 5 Focus. So right now, it's going to be... 7, 7, 7, 21. 21 plus 5... 26. I'll take 4 damage versus defend hyper beam. I'm taking 4 damage anyways, but I kill 2 of them. But then I don't get the focus. Alright, so we're going to take 4 damage anyways, right? That was quick. But I, that was quick? You're being kappa, right? You're being kappa? Because that was, that, was uh, that was a long time off. <laughs> Welcome back, Morgan Fire. 4 months in a row. Four years in a row to the germ pool. Welcome back, buddy. Appreciate it, man. Thank you. Thank you for the support. I meant to do four after that, but you, you know what I meant. You know what I meant. <coughs> steroid pot. Now, we can use steroid pot as a way to gain... No. Skim, I like it. Oh my boys, this is a this is a spicy one. It's a spicy one, laddie. See, having two streamlines was kind of awkward, though. Man, I don't I don't like the damage I'm taking at all. Probably should have done streamline there and take. I didn't take damage anyways, so I just do streamline and maybe make the fight easier for myself. Like so. That guy's doing 22. That guy's insane. Um, let me see. Streamline's gonna be doing 30 to that guy. So I would have to get lucky. If I just streamline last turn, that guy would be dead. I would have to get lucky, right? Well, this would, we can also just block, right? The frost? Is it enough? I guess I could use steroid pot actually. And kill him. But then this guy's doing damage. Kind of like Bias Cognition, Buffer Cold Snap. Uh, not really, actually. Because that's not going to be... That's going to be... Okay. I'll have 8, 8, 8, 24. Yeah, and then the buffer covers that. It depends on who attacks first. I think either way, we're fine, actually. It depends on who attacks first. No, it doesn't. It doesn't matter. My god, this has been a lot of spicy, spicy, spicy runs. It's 21. Hyper Beam is not enough to kill that guy, but if I do Seek on the Streamline, it is enough, right? Man, these are some spicy runs. I am getting low, 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 low. 
Whoa, we got orange pellets. Well, here's the problem with orange pellets here, right? Hey, what's up, Trout? Yo, welcome back, man. I, I'm very curious to try that thing you told me. I, I'm very, like, you got me, you got me, uh, peaked. You peaked me. You wet me. You what, mate? You wet me. W-H-E-T. Um, orange pellets can deny the bias recognition part, and then I could do, like, hyper beam for the artifacts, and then do, you know, or bias recognition orange pellets. But the thing is, it doesn't get rid of the negative part of hyper beam, because the negative part of hyper beam is just getting rid of your focus. It's not like as if I'll do this, and I'll get my focus back, you know what I mean? I feel like I actually want a focus pot. No, I haven't had lucky. My power's been out, and then I had to go do an errand. I, obviously, my background's changed. You guys noticed the background's changed, and I just got back my power now. I'm, I got on as soon as my power came back. Yeah, I think I want to buy a focus pot for the the boss. Although the boss is a little bit a little bit as a ways. Mm, I'm gonna do focus pot. I'm gonna remove strike. Stay alive. Yeah, I don't know about this. Is there another shop? There is. Glacier. I have juicy bracelets, so I'm not worried about... Oh, so this is what I was talking about, guys. I was talking about how Mind Bloom can help me get all the upgrades because I have, you know, this fusion hammer. But the problem is, I, last time I got it really late. This time I'm getting it when I'm pretty low and I don't want to be low. So, I'll go for the rare relic. I could go for the curse and get the full heal. No, because I'm going to have to rest anyways. I have to rest anyways because of fusion hammer. So, it would be nice, obviously, to get the... Um... I probably think I should do steroid pie here. Oh, we're having trouble killing this guy. Uh, what if we do both? Why would I? I never thought I was going to have to use potions against this guy. This guy's kicking my ass. This guy's kicking my ass. Fuck, boys. Focus pot, I guess? No. I don't have to do this, right? I just, I'm going to survive. Right, we're going to be fine. I can persevere. I'm trying not to, to do something like a potion. Because I think I can handle this guy. But at the same time... So there's a few outs. We can get Hyper Beam as an out. We can do Buffer and just block his attack. There's a few outs. Uh, I'm going to take the risk. That never ends well, but... That never ends well, does it? Okay. Sheesh. Thank God, dude. Thank God. That was scary. Alright, we're good. Perfect fight now. It was the beginning that was a little bit scary, but now we're perfect, perfecto. This is how I expect the, you know, awakening fight to go a little bit, except of my powers are going to power him up. Should probably leave lightning up. Do I care about the perfects? I mean, there's no reason to rush this. Let's be honest. Ain't no reason to take damage. Ba -da -da. What rare relic is he gonna give me? Lucky pick. Calipers. That's not bad. Compile for card draw. Got the skim. Got cool headed. That's not upgraded. Skim is always. Well, there's skim and there's compile. If we keep the stereo pot, skim, uh, compile could be useful. Can probably pick up the zero cost streamlines eventually. Still think I'll okay, think I'll okay keep skipping here. 
Chill, leap, barrage. Barrage could be a way to do some damage with Stereo Pot and Inserter. I might pick up a barrage. Do I need it though? I mean, it could help. You never know. A barrage with like a Stereo Pot could be, could be something. Now, I'm thinking about the leap a little bit as well. I'll do a barrage. I'll pick it up. You want to go for an elite or not? It's like... Nemesis, I think we're okay against. Giant Head, I think we're okay against a Giant Head. I, I think... I, the, the Double Trouble guys, whatever. Double Pusher Bros. Oh, this is a rough fight, actually. Sometimes. Wow, why is the AI so different, guys? This guy usually spawns and attacks and does all these other crazy things. The AI's been so weird today. I have to read the patch notes, guys. White noise, beam cell machine learning. Now, white noise is nice, and there's a two out of three chance it's gonna be awakened one. I still think even even so, I don't mind. Um, fairy in the bottle. No, I'm gonna skippy skippy. Do I keep this for the frail or just try to get bias? If I get bias, I'll use it, of course. Or I can stop the frail. Uh, I had a power out of this young EGG. So if you want, man, join the Discord. And you can get filled in on why things like that happen, man. It was, it was just completely random. My power went out. And uh, in the middle of the stream, I was like... Oh, fuck me. What's up, Latharina? Yeah, I had a power outage. Sorry, guys. I I, get, I need another way to announce it outside of Discord. Because a lot of people who don't use Discord, they didn't realize what happened. But all I can do is put Discord on my phone. I guess I could use Twitter. Welcome, uh... Welcome, uh, Grace. How was the... How was work? You still at work? But yeah, if you guys want to do exclamation point Discord, you guys can join. I, I, I put uh, announcements and stuff of wh why things like that happen. Not like that happens often, but you know, if it ever happens, you guys can be filled in. What's up, Vega? How you doing, man? Cool, guys. Cool. We get to rest, which we're going to rest because we we're forced to rest. And then we're probably going to rest again if we take no damage. Since from here... Uh, another cool headed? Wait. Oh, too late. Ooh, Echo Form would have been sick. Another Barrage, which to help get Kunai and also just because it's crazy with Inserter. Or Trip, because it does a um, Vulnerable, and that's kind of nice against Donodeka especially. Yeah, I'll do Trip. That's sexy. That's sexy. Uh-oh, this guy. Oh, I can stop his negative effects, right? Oh, that's really nice. I was going to do Bias, but it's like, you can either do Bias or stop this guy's main effects. What do you want to do? He stopped his main effects. He's pretty manageable when he doesn't have to do that. I only have Zap? Oh no, I don't need Bolin, I have a Barrage. And streamlines and stuff. Oh, is he doing the effect again? Does he try to do it twice? Does he try to do it twice? If that's the case, that guy's an ass. Wow, he tries to do it again if he doesn't get it the first time. That guy is persistent. I mean, I commend him, but like, Jesus.
I'm not sure if do we have enough block we have 16 plus 12 he's doing 30 33 I don't have enough but if I cold snap then I do I want to barrage Oh, I just told you a power outage. Oh, fuck. This guy's... He's all up in there, man. I think I have to use focus pot. Oh. I hate this guy. Didn't want to have to do that. Didn't want to have to do that, but I'm trying to preserve my life, guys. Right, I want to be healthy as can be. Maybe that was premature. Maybe I'm a prima donna, premature. I did things I didn't need to do, and now I, I refer to myself in past tense as why I can't concur. Don't know what I'm saying. Remember, guys, I, I woke up today really tired, and we're still tired. In fact, we're even tired because of all the heat. We're f full life. Oh, I'm gonna skip, skip, skip. Okay, guys. Uh, so we can do bias condition right off the bat. Yes, please. White noise. Okay. I could have done steroid steroid technically. So I want to be able to block the first hit so I don't get the damn buffer taken away. But lo and behold, the buffer gets taken away. So we're going to attack anyways. Yeah, that's awesome. Thank you. I am. We got this, boys. Sometimes you don't hear what I say. Damn. Feels bad, man. Feels bad, man. I should defend after the kunai, but we're good. We're good. Yikes. Yikes. That's a three buffer right there. Isa feels bad, man. Get rid of his damn artifacts. Yo, Lotharina, thank you for the 200 bits and for the, the nice little micro bits. I uh, I gotta get the announcement going for you, one sec. You know, Mooksy's being a little lazy boy. We don't like that. Do we can we afford to do let's just keep doing this? We're not doing hyperbeam, right? That's crazy. I mean that's damage, it's 51 damage. It's crazy though. Barrage though, I think I'll do barrage now. Oh baby. Oh baby, that's satisfying. That is satisfying. Now if you guys are not watching the stream and just hearing to the audio, you're probably wondering what the hell I'm going on about. Oh baby, that's satisfying. I know it sounds funny. But that's what happens when you play defects. Nostrum is just a nice way to get kunai, you know what I mean? You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? I wanna get, I wanna get rid of his artifacts. I got five dexterity on top of everything else we already got in terms of focus. Sexy, man. Thank you so much for all the bits. Pick a one, how you doing, man?
Alright. Uh-oh, it's a war. It's a bit war. So Jamal Sinsu's putting his 12 in there. He's got a piece of it. He's letting you guys have a piece of his mind. Uh, we'll see what's next. Either uh, Waking One or Time Eater. And if we win this, guys, we are back-to-back -back winning. Back-to-back -back winning, guys. No science involved. Only power outages. But the power outages can't stop us. Alright, who's it gonna be? Who's the... Ooh, you know what? I like this. I just gotta make sure to get... My, I, I'm gonna do Stereo Pot. Because he's about to do negative effects, I gotta do... I gotta get Stereo Pot up. So, by his condition, I'm sorry. But, we gotta do what we gotta do. Because I don't wanna waste it for nothing. And I might as well have strength, right? I think I'm gonna do Buffer here. Although, okay. Cold Snap. You know, this is a great time to have Buffer, actually. It's so clutch. So, so clutch. Let's try to get some dexterity going. One thing we don't have is a weaken, which is problematic. Very problematic. I mean, I I don't mind a weaken one either, though, because weaken ones, I can I can handle it. I would say. Okay. So far, so good. We don't have the bias cognition. That's the only problem. Electro. I mean, if it's free, I'll play it, but... Oh, my bad. I should have done defrag first. This is where I, rat where I wish I had orange pellets here. It was on this moment. He wished he had orange pellets. Spending all my time blocking is not a good thing, but I do want to get loop out. We have time to do barrage later. We do have five strength. So barrage is pretty important. It's so is the vulnerable. I want to get kunai here. Is it worth it, or should I just block? I can get a kunai. But I, I'll be taking damage, and that's not good. We're gonna take damage anyways, but I don't want to take that much damage. Hey, what's up, Kalia? How you doing? Alright, so now we have the vulnerable, so Barrage is looking pretty sexy. No weakened sucks, huh? Ooh, 104. So where's the hyper beam when you where's the uh dual cast when you need it? Do we want to do hyper beam now? 58 damage? I mean I mean if we can guarantee that we get the kill next turn, nah we can't. I have two cards next turn though. That is a good run. All that energy wasted. Alright. Foolish, foolish. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, it's not worth it, boys. We just seen hologram, and we win. Hologram, and we win. Woo! Yeah, buddy. And the reason my broad was so lethal is because we had the steroid pot. Remember when I said I went to the shop? I said, you know, we could do steroid pot with the artifact. We had options. We had options, guys. It's all about having the options, hedging your bets, right? So we had potions to work with we had different ways to do different things we didn't only do frost and things we you know we had intruder of course which is awesome and we had barrage we had, we had things it was cool two back-to-back -back wins pretty damn sexy